Hello guys, welcome back to another tutorial from Xenotrust on Dokkan customization. So um, this is our product edit page, okay, or our edit product page. And um, there are two descriptions here. There's a short description and there's a description. So some of your vendors might, may find this confusing, okay. So in order to keep things simple, some people have said they would like to remove the description, okay, from the flow of the page, okay. So they just want short description and then inventory. So I'll show you how to remove this description, which typically stands for long description, but it's not absolutely necessary for your product um, to be uploaded on the vendor's dashboard. So this is how you remove the description. First off, you need to go to your um, WordPress installation file, and this is what it should look like. So um, yes. Now go into the WP hacking content and go into the plugin and then within the plugin come to your Dokkan light and open it up and then within the template open it up and copy this product folder okay to your child theme. So basically I'm just going to copy this and I'll go to my child theme so content themes and child theme. So within this child theme, there is this Dokkan folder I created, and and um, this is the products folder here. I've already pasted it before. Now, if I open this products folder, you see that there are several folders here. Now, the folder I need to edit here, or the file I need to edit, is the new product single dot php. So I'm going to click on this and open it up in my code editor, and. I'm going to um, come to line 416. So around the area, you should see code that looks like this. Okay, so div, div with the class of Dokkan product description. Okay, and just above it, there is this div with the um, class of Dokkan product shop description. So this is what I'm interested in. I'll put my cursor here and I'll add a comment. Okay, and then. I'll make sure to close the comments at the end here. Okay, so this is exactly what you should do. So from line 416 to line 418 at the end here. Next, I'll just save this and let's refresh the page and see. So this is the description I want to get rid of. Just after short description, I'll refresh the page and let's see. Okay. So we have short description and inventory. So essentially, we've been able to um, trim our product edit page. Okay, so to just the basics we need for um, you know our vendors to set up a product. Okay, so there's short description and then there's inventory where they can then put in stock management and select how many product they have in stock and they can specify a stock keeping unit and then. If the product is out of stock, they can specify that the product is out of stock and stuff like that. And then they can simply just save. So I believe that the um, edit product page is a, little, a lot smaller. If you um, are wondering how we got rid of some of the options here, then check the link in the description. There is a playlist for Dokkan customizations. Um, if you are not subscribed to my channel, make sure to subscribe. Thank you so much. See you in another video.